Okay, so is this still recording? Good. Okay. Apparently, if I change desktops, and it doesn't keep recording. All right. So footprints. Let me get back to the top here. Okay. So. Instead of G a D, D flat, and C minor. So that's what we're working with for first. And the next thing that we need to work on now is adapting this for footprints. So C minor, C minor, C minor, F minor, F minor, G. It's no longer there. And instead of G, we have D and D flat. Okay. So what are we looking at for notes here? For C minor, here are the notes that I would like you to think about. C, D, E flat, F, G, a, B flat. It's actually a Dorian scale, but that works nicely. Okay. For F minor, F, G, A flat, B flat, C, D, E flat. Okay. For D, this is the only three notes that I, that I suggest that you uh, worry about right now. D, F sharp, and A. For D flat, it's everything just down. So you'll have D flat, excuse me, F, and A flat. Okay. Um, yeah, that's that. So let's see what happens when we use these notes. Here's the F minor. Back to C. And then here comes the D. flat, back to C minor, and there's my cap. Get down from, get down, down, nope, not the piano, he's playing piano. Off, 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 off. Okay, so how did I get those notes for those scales? Well, that's for another episode, my friends. Um, we'll talk about that another time, but that should get you started on playing around with improvising on this piece. Okay, enjoy.